Hello ladies and gentlemen, Callista Wibri Ducks here with another redstone tutorial for you guys. Today we are making, yes, another randomizer, but this one just has a 50-50 chance, two outputs, so it's like flipping a quarter and you either get heads or tails. So here's the whole thing you can see right in front of me. Let's go ahead and press this button. And I got command block set up right now just for the outputs. There you see we got heads, heads, heads. Heads, tails, there we go. Randomizers always work funky when I'm recording. Gotta love it. But there you go, it does have 50-50 chances of landing on either heads or tails. It's very quick, it only takes about a tick to react. And as you can see, it's pretty small. So let's go ahead and see how it's built. Okay, so as usual, we're gonna go ahead and start with the red block as our power source. Let's go ahead and put a hopper dropper combo directly behind the button and as well one right next to it facing upward let's put a hopper on top and one right there I learned this little trick that you can hold shift and spacebar at the same time so you can click on top of things without moving up or down love it okay let's go ahead and place two blocks below so we're gonna put one comparator coming out of this dropper another comparator coming out of this dropper so this dropper will be compared to what's inside this dropper and this is going to be one of our outputs we can go ahead and put a command block there although it's not necessary obviously now for the next output we're gonna go ahead and put a block right there we're gonna have a comparator coming out of the hopper instead of the dropper on this side block right here with the comparator facing towards that comparator then we're gonna go ahead and use a furnace although you could use a dropper or anything else that holds items so now inside of this furnace we're gonna go ahead and place nine items of anything stackable up to 16 so eggs work you could also use ender pearls or snowballs I believe now in this dropper over here we're gonna go ahead and put 16 plus 5 so let's take one of these and in this dropper we are going to put one item one item stackable to 16 and one non stackable item like a wooden shovel right there and there you have it it's pretty much done this is our other output so we'll go ahead and put in a command we'll make this one tails and we will make this one heads and now when you press the button you can see the output we got tails tails again heads and there you have it a randomizer with 50 50 odds of getting two different outputs so let's go ahead and take a quick look at how this works when I press this button it activates both this dropper and this dropper right here now this dropper is actually what determines the odds there's a 50 50 chance of the egg being selected and versus the wooden shovel being selected now if the wooden shovel is selected what happens here is the hopper is has a stronger signal than what's inside this furnace here so this comparator will turn on and this output will happen now at the same time this dropper has a certain number of items which if the shovel is selected it'll go up and this will beat the signal through here now if the egg is selected because this is losing one item down here it actually makes this signal stronger than this one so signal will go through here so there you have it hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a like if you did or if it helped you out and I will see you guys next time